Unfolding the Excitement, the Rising Action in Storytelling. Hello there, English language learners. Today, we're diving deeper into the world of storytelling. Our focus will be on an incredibly important component of the story plot structure, the rising action. Understanding and being able to identify this part of a story can not only enhance your listening skills but also improve your speaking abilities when you're telling your own stories. Before we delve into rising action, it's crucial to understand the overall plot structure. A typical story is divided into five parts, exposition, rising action, climax, falling action, and resolution. Each of these parts contributes to the overall narrative and how the story is perceived by the reader or listener. But, our spotlight today is on the rising action. So, what exactly is rising action? This is the stage in a story where the main character encounters a series of events or conflicts that lead up to the climax. It builds upon the exposition, or the initial stage of the story, and prepares us for the thrilling peak, or the climax. The rising action serves to heighten the tension, engage the audience's interest, and drive the story forward. It's like the climbing portion of a roller coaster ride, full of anticipation. Identifying rising action in a story is not as hard as you might think. It typically begins after the exposition, once the main characters, their goals, and the setting have been established. This is when the problems start to occur and the characters are faced with obstacles they need to overcome. It's the section of the story where things start to get complicated and exciting. The rising action is not only for reading or listening to stories, but it's also for when you are the storyteller. When telling a story, it's vital to build suspense and engage your listeners. This could mean describing challenges that the main character must overcome, introducing new characters who bring conflict, or presenting surprising events that twist the story in unexpected ways. That wraps up our lesson on rising action. We've learned what it is, where to find it in a story, and how to use it in our own storytelling. Remember, the rising action is all about escalating tension and excitement. It's the ramp that propels the story towards its peak. Keep practicing, and soon you'll find yourself spotting the rising action effortlessly in any story and even using it in your own spoken narratives. Happy storytelling, and until our next lesson, keep learning and exploring the beauty of the English language.